welcome to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Tamia, and those of you who are joining me again, thank you for joining. Today I'm going to show you exactly how I got this glowy, natural, smoky glam. Um, or should I say it's a neutral smoky glam because it's not as natural just because my eyes are smoked out. Um, with using browns, I didn't use any blacks. Um, I kept it very color safe. So I could wear with a bright red, the bright red jumpsuit that you guys seen me in not too long ago. Um, so I wanted to give you guys the quick to do on how to achieve this look. So if you guys stay tuned, you can see how I did it. Photo finish shadow primer from Smashbox where I apply the shadow. I'm going in with my Naked Heat palette from Urban Decay. These are the colors. I'm gonna stay here. And these oranges, these burnt orange and brown. Start with heat, which is the burnt orange. And I'm just gonna go in my crease. Take stripe, which is the darker color. I'm gonna do the same over here. Take my blending brush and just blend this out. Sumatra and Sumatra is the dark color. This is from 
Smashbox. I'm going to go in deeper. I'm just deepening the other brown. So now for my lid, I'm going to go in with my Laura Mercier Hidden Gems palette. And I'm going in with, let's skip the color first, one, two, three. I'm going in with Tiger's Eye, so I'm going to show you which color that is without trying to let the fallout from this other color come out. So it's the third one, it's this color right here that I'm going to go in with for my lid color. I'm just going to use my finger for a application and literally just placing it and blending it with my finger right in there For a little more dimension, I'm going to add Rose Quartz, which is this light color right there. I'm going to add that to the center of my lid right about there. Just for a little more dimension. I just blend that in together. Take my blending brush again just to make sure this baby looks seamless. I'm going to do my under eye. For my under eye, I'm going with the Naked Palette and I'm going to use Stripe, which is the brown. Going with my NARS Black Moon pencil, I'm going to get in my waterline. Sometimes there's no pretty way for me to do that liner and video it, so. That is what you guys get. Um, I'm going to go in now with my dose of color Shady. And this is a liner that I'm going to use. And I'm literally just going to do the outside corner of my eye just to elongate it some. I'm going to go in with my NARS Climax to do my lashes um, and then I'm going to put on some Ardell's which I doubled up on the Wispies and the 122's to give it an extra effect. And end deep one for my concealer from Cover FX.
For this look, I use Sasha powder for my under eye and as my like black powder. So I'm using this for it today. I'm going to blend all this out. So now that I have done that, I'm going to go in and do my blush. I'm going to do my contour. So I'm going to go in and do my contour with my NARS, the Atomic Blonde palette. The contour is Unleashed. For my blush, I'm gonna go in with MAC Raisin. And it looks like this. I use it a lot, obviously. Definitely a throwback. For my highlight, I'm gonna go with my Stardust Radiant Glow from Laura Mercier. And I'm going to use these two colors. So first this one, then this one. I'm just going to take a fan brush. So this is what gives me like the bronze look, the bronzed glow. And then I go over it with the, what color is that? With the champagne melange to give me the highlight that I want, like the perfect color. So this is the rose gold that I just used that I am blending. Now I'm going to go in with the champagne. It gives me a way different effect, but I love them combined. I don't know if you can really see, like, I'm gonna go in now with my Laura Mercier palette and hit my, the inside of my eyes with this lighter color. Okay, so for my lips, I'm gonna go in with this um, strip down pencil from MAC. I'm just gonna outline, I'm gonna line my whole entire lip. Now I'm going to go in with Urban Decay 1993. It's a comfort matte lip. And I love it, obviously, because I've used it down. It's a nice nude for my skin tone. That is that. Now I'm going to go in with Urban Decay number 66. It's also a comfort matte. This has a little more, um, it's a little more mauve -y, So it's going to add a little blush tone to my lip. There you have it this is the look i hope you guys enjoy watching this tutorial if you guys have any comments or questions let me know what you want to see more of and just drop them in the comment box below if you haven't already subscribed please subscribe and tell a friend tell all your friends to come watch um and i will see you guys next time